welcome. We have today this fighter, this amazing woman of courage, of independence, a bold warrior as it were, Iram Sharmila, for an interview with the citizen in the news click. Iram, it's a pleasure to have met you and an honor really. And how are you feeling today now that after so many years you've given up your, uh, you know, fast? Become alive completely. You have? Become alive. Alive, really? And you, uh, and now, um, what is going to be your next move? Since my deep man, my protest for the right cause is still yet to be fulfilled, I am planning to change my strategy with democratic electoral politics to help heart of my voice. So do you think, you know, that you've taken up this Armed Forces Special Pass Act issue so forcefully with your fast, but nobody listened, right? No government would listen. People listened, but the governments did not listen. I think governments Mm. Adam and nature is also mm, consequent effect on the mainstream media because I feel the national media are only interested in me and my breaking of fast, but they, they are not interested in knowing of the real situation of Manipur, of how they live, of how they pass. The true. They're not interested in the real issues. That is so true. They, they, they should come to Manipur also and uh, mm, just yeah. meet with all this. But you remote had people. You, yeah, but the state, you know, the issue that you took up is something that is beyond Manipur. You took it up because of Manipur, but it's something which even all the way till Kashmir also people used to look at you. So, do you think your role now will be bigger than just one state? Encompass all affected states also in a democratic country and uh, the union government should respect the sentiments of the people in a multi cultural country without connecting the hearts of the people uh, with the sense of um, the uh, people's representation um, so as to bring the real integrity of India and the real peace of India Everything, every issue can be solved with mutual understanding and uh, loving kindness without any tools of violence because our heart is malleable and uh, is an example of um, civilization and the uh, highest living entity of God's creation. We need the sense of civilization in everything else, 
without any enforcement of mm, contradictory rules or regulations. But when you started the fast so many years ago, did you think at all, Iran, that you would have to fast for such a long time? You were more optimistic, I'm sure, at that time, right? I just felt optimistic and uh, um, hopeful to the will of God. But I had seen nothing about my um, future by then. I just believe in the principle of non-violence as how India became independent with the tools of non-violence. But in my generation, those who are proud of the original I mean the uh, being the source of non-violence in, in the uh, my failure due to their negligence of non-violent principles is a you thought it sham would, yeah. to the world, mm. for the Indians, to the world. So when you uh, called off your fast, had you decided, were you thinking of doing that for a while or was it a sudden decision? Not sudden. Mm. After persevering for such long years after frustrations of such long year after year when I was released every year uh, with the penalty of one year under the Indian Penal Code, mm, Section 309, the concerned authority remain unheard of my real voice. So you, uh, there was a lot of criticism from groups uh, about you calling off the fast. I mean, many of us thought that that was not a fair criticism because, you know, you had led this whole um, uh, struggle against AFSPA almost single-handedly and it was your right to take a decision. So how would you respond to those people who are criticizing you for this? They did just misunderstand of my break of fast, but in their inner feeling, they remain respecting me and uh, their emotion for me still remain unseen, I think. For example, after refusing me to accept or giving my shelter in a lo locality. Those, mm, the same locality came to realize of what they done to me. What are you going to do? What's like if today you want to say, what are you going to do the next step? By forming a new party with a new symbol based on our people's sentiments, based on its suffering, everything, based on our reason, uh, with the convention of inclusiveness, 
will form a new party. In a political in, in party, kind of Yes, thing. political party in a short period. And uh, the next um, election is very near from now. And uh, I'm hopeful. Will you confine the party to Manipur or will you look at a general party cutting across some of the states in the northeast? I don't want to com confine it to Manipur's problems only because all the northeast states are similarly suffering from discriminations, racial attacks and uh, other um, backwardness uh, due to the um, system of politics which is absolutely based on the national policies without regarding the sentiments of the people there yes. in the northeast without connecting hearts um, without um, regarding what they do what they want so this is, um, you know, a lot of the parties in the Northeast and some of the states also in Manipur like to ally with one of the so-called national parties, which is Congress or BJP or something. Uh, how, you're going to remain independent, I guess. No, we'll form a new party. New party and you will not ally with any of the Delhi parties. Recently, um, on an invitation from the Am Admi Party, mm -hmm. I met with the chief minister only because he, mm, mm, he invited me and the I felt mm, as it had been mm, struggling mm, for long mm, for anti-corruption movement mm, as I think mm, a symbol of people's power in politics. I felt I need counseling. How did they win? How can we connect with people? Like that. Like that. So I'm going to end with a personal question. When are you getting married? Right now I can, can say um, uh, I, I mm, mm, Determined not to get married until and unless my goal is achieved. And the goal is? Goal, goal. Change in the order or revocation, abrogation of APSPA, which would you say is the goal now? My main focus is on repealing that very APSPA. And uh, um, other relevant um, goes for the sake of justice, love and understanding. Um, there is a collective goal, and uh, I want the whole world. Um, not to politicia, uh, politicize of my love life. And I want the people of Manipur also to see me as a humanity, not just a symbol of resistance. Thank you for watching uh, News Click and The Citizen will be back again with the next interview very soon. Thank you.